Hello, KW family. My name is Estin Dewey, the bug reporter for the day. Yay, yay. <laughs> um, hope y'all had a great weekend. I know I did uh, celebrating my birthday. Um, pretty exciting, you know, celebrating another year. Uh, I'm not excited about getting older, but I'm, I'm excited to live another year, so I, I do appreciate that. Um, anyway, um, I'm going to go over a bug that is dealing with context uh, today. You know me, I love context. So, um, anyway... Uh, this bug was occurring when trying to import contacts and when putting a address on the other address section of the CSV file, the address was not showing anywhere on the contact card. All right, so now this is now this can be pretty like annoying because sometimes you will have contacts that do not have a primary address and or a mailing address, but a address that they do use and will need to show that particular address on the contact card. Okay, all right, so that's good. Well, let's get into it. Um, uh, you can see here on this contact card that um, this contact card does not have any addresses at all. All right, so after importing them, they usually show somewhere around here. All right, so we're going to see if this book is fixed. But first, we're going to download a blank CSV file. All right, so now we're going to go to import. All right. Then click this button here. All right, so for time purposes, I already done that, and I'm gonna show you my CSV file. All right, so here you can see um, the CSV file. Put the first name, last name, and then here there's no primary address, there's no mailing address, but there's the other address, and we put the address here. All right, so now we're gonna import it to see if it will show on the contact card. All right, so let's try this. So. We're already here since we already here to um, import the um, CSV file we're going to click let's go here browser and then we're going to go to downloads and then we're going to hit this one to grab that CSV file okay all right now we're going to click import contacts all right voila successfully imported now let's see we'll try to find that contact name Mike Lowry see if the address shows all right and voila see now this book is fixed okay so um now the only workaround uh to fix this was to actually manually add an address to the contact card all right so if it did not import the address there on the other address section you will just manually add the address there okay so there you have it when importing a contact and only putting a address in the other address section of the CSV file, um, it is finally showing up on the contact card. All right. So if you have any questions um, or this issues, you know, happening to you or any other issues in command, you know how to contact us either by email or live chat. I'm telling you, we'll be glad to help. All right. So thank you all for always tuning in. Um, I hope you all uh, continue being safe, continue learning and continue enjoying life and having fun, all right? So I'll check y'all later, all right, bye.